Williams, your host for the American Dream Selling Coeur d'Alene. And I'm John Williams, co-host. We are so excited. We're going to talk this segment about the lifestyle of luxury, but also living right on the river in Coeur d'Alene. We're going to be talking all things Standcraft, Standcraft wooden boats, Standcraft construction, the Jet Center, and the Marine Group. I'm excited too. Let's go take a look. Let's go. here with Forrest Walker with the Standcraft Companies and we are on one of the most amazing wooden boats out there. Forrest, tell us what makes the Standcraft wooden boats so special. Um, I mean, I think the obvious beauty is the big draw in initially. Obviously seeing a, you know, a 40 foot wood boat built out of mahogany is uh, pretty astonishing, but the, the ride is really what, uh, what I say sells the boats it, it, it opens up big water for people so on a lake like Coeur d'Alene where you have restaurants up to 16 to 20 miles away you can hop in your boat and do 45 miles an hour 50 and feel like you're going 20 with practically no wind and no chop it's just a it's an astonishing feeling to be out on one of our boats they truly ride different than any other boat in the world Wow Jory is the vice president of the Standcraft Companies. Jory, welcome. Thank you. Well, I'm so glad to be here. Tell me more about how the Standcraft Companies began. Well, obviously, uh, 90 plus years ago, it started with uh, Billy and Stan Young. Um, oh. They started the company out of a passion for craftsmanship and boats. Wow, it's amazing to see the process and how long it may take to perfect. Yes, well, you figure every boat in this bay is roughly a six plus thousand hour boat. Wow, they're beautiful. What is your vision for the future? Uh, honestly, maintain, keep making the boats better. Mm -hmm. um, obviously look to streamline. We might add some new models, uh, possibly even different materials in those models. Um, keep putting them out, growing the companies, adding jobs to the community, um, and keep making people some of the most beautiful toys there are on the lake. The most beautiful toys there are, <laughs> for sure. Yeah, thank you, it's Absolutely. been awesome. My pleasure. I'm here now with Josh Horvath. He's the president of the Stancraft Construction Group. How are you today? I'm doing great. And this beautiful day. Tell me more about how you guys got started with Stancraft Construction. So Rob and Amy Bloom, um, they're the owners of Stancraft Companies and they had a need to build some buildings. And so Rob and I uh, started Stancraft Construction Company uh, two years ago and now we're up to 102 people. So wow. we're really expanding. So we're just finishing up this custom home right here on the Spokane River. And- wow. um, it's a beauty, wow. Thanks. And then we've got some commercial projects throughout the Post Falls, Coeur d'Alene, Spokane Valley, and the Hayden area. Wow, you guys have really got a pulse on what's going on to have so many projects going in a short amount of time. I'm here with Joe Rossetti, the general manager of the Stancraft Jet Center. Joe, tell me, what was the inspiration for the Jet Center? So the inspiration was really to take the core values and the service levels that a lot of the boat customers had received mm. in the past and really apply that towards the aviation industry. So this is an amazing facility. What do your clients really appreciate about the Stancraft Jet Center? So I think what the clients really appreciate are the little details, the subtle nuances, everything that was put into the building to not only reflect the brand, but also just the idea of everything is exquisite. So Joe, thank you for showing us the amazing Stancraft Jet Center and helping us wrap up our tour of all things Stancraft. Absolutely. It's, we Absolutely. really appreciate the opportunity. Thank you. Thank you very much, Leo. This is Leah Williams, your host of American Dream TV Coeur d'Alene. Thank you so much to Stancraft. This has been amazing. We hope to catch you next time.